Excellent. Paul here, Music Villa, Bozeman, Montana, with my friend Corey Congelio with Martin Guitars. And we are looking at a cool little custom shop. What do you think of that one? Man, I love Martins that are maple because yep. you don't see it all the time. I do too. And it, they always knock it out of the park. It's yep. really, really cool. I love them as well. I do a lot of these small bodies in maple. And they're great. They're really, really awesome little guitars. This one's Bird's Eye Maple. Mm -hmm. This was a trip back to Martin, you know, hanging out in the custom shop there and just coming up with little ideas. And like I said, I usually do a lot of these small bodies. This one I think is just came out amazing. I love the Art Deco uh, rosette and the, and, the, and the inlay here. It is just a really cool guitar. The little stamp on the back. Yeah. It's amazing. Um, it's classy for sure. Yeah. You know, but it's not one of those things that just looks cool. It sounds really, really great. It does. It yeah. sounds great. It, it is classy. It reminds me of just like an old kind of a vintage guitar. You know, mm -hmm. it really has a nice, clean look. It's not over. I've done another one of these that's just got tons of inlay. You saw yeah. that. Oh, yeah, yeah. That one's cool too. But this one's just more... It's kind of more of this a This is a player, for sure. Player. And this is the kind of guitar for, and I know, because I've, I've done a bunch of events with Martin over the years, and, and somebody says, I have a Dread, I have a Triple O, um, you know, and maybe I have some other brands. I want something that's really different. Yeah, this, this is, it. is it. And this is what they call a Double O, and it's an S, which is sloped here. Right. So it's a little more sloped. It's a Double O body shape, a little more sloped. The neck, we were talking about that earlier. Mm -hmm. The neck is it's my favorite you know, for my limited abilities of uh, of guitar, it's my favorite neck shape. And you were playing it, and you you said the same thing. You love this neck. Upstairs, I was like, you have to tell me what this is yep. because, you know, like all of pe all these people watching, probably they you know pine to build a custom shop, Martin, at some point. Yep. And the biggest hangup for me is the neck shape. Yep. So that's why I tell people just get out and play them. You got you know, it. And yep. and it's great because there's so many models and different kinds of neck shapes, you'll, you'll definitely find one that will suit you, and yeah. I think I did. And this, this is, is called cool. full thickness, so it's really, really actually really chunky on the back. Yeah. But it's a 1 on 11 16 nut width, and it's, like I said, for me it's the same thing. I just, you know. Mm -hmm. No, it fits right in your hand really well. It fits really good. You don't have to squeeze that hard. Everyone's different. But yeah, you got to spend time yep. with it when you sit down and, and really see how it feels after more than five or ten minutes. Yeah. I mean, you gotta spend 30 minutes That's for, sure. you know, at first. Yep. I've had people go, oh, I love this neck, and then, you know, two days later they come back and go, this thing's killing my hand. Right. right. And uh, it's just a matter of finding, not just the nut width, but finding the right shape on the back. Yeah, nut width is really important, um, for sure, and you just gotta experiment. Yep. Well, yeah. I appreciate you coming down. This is the Custom Shop Bird's Eye. Yeah. Double O. It's a great guitar. Come down to Music Villa and check it out. Corey, as always, thank you. My pleasure. We'll see you soon.